corneal edema one week after a DMEC. This patient has had an endothelial keratoplasty, a DMEC, because of Fuchs endothelial dystrophy. Now they had the procedure and one week after the operation they just feel that their vision is misty, hasn't really improved at all after the surgery and if anything it's got worse. Now here we can see in this video that there are a significant amount of decimase folds. You can see those crisscross appearances, those decimase folds there and quite frank corneal edema. Look how thick the cornea is. Now you can also see some almost cystic-like changes there go in the middle, you can see those, and at the top there, there's a band of cysts as well. Let's just have a look there, and maybe we can put some fluorescein in and see whether the appearance changes at all. So, in this patient, they also have epithelial edema, which is manifesting as these bullae changes, and you see this really stippled appearance, those speckled and stippled appearance that you see there, which is accentuated with a yellow filter or a ratin filter, and this is pathognomic for epithelial edema, which you might actually also see in a patient with acute angle closure glaucoma too. Now this patient has detachment of their endothelial graft which was implanted into the eye, and what they need to have is a procedure called rebubbling, so injection of either air or gas into the anterior chamber to help to oppose and affix the endothelial graft up until the host interface. And hopefully, this will allow it to function again, clear the cornea and improve the patient's vision. This is a known complication after endothelial keratoplasty. I hope you found this video useful and let me know what you think.